Hey guys, I'm Ilan Martinez, editor of Shark Tower Magazine, and this is my video blog, Notes from a Shark Junkie's Journal. Um, I was actually, I wanted to, today I wanted to talk to you guys about some footage that I found. Uh, a couple of years ago, I was out with uh, Stuart Cove, and we went out to the weather buoys to, to dive with silky sharks. We were going to go out there, and what we were doing was, you know, we were checking out the silky sharks, but at the same time, um, these silky sharks get caught by fishermen all the time, and most of what they do is they just, they cut the they cut the line and these sharks have these hooks so we were when we were out there we were putting the sharks in tonic immobility and we were removing as many of the of the hooks as possible so later when I'm reviewing the footage you know I'm obviously we have you know I wanted to go through it and see what we had uh, you know some great stuff of silkies and 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 then while I was going through the footage I was going frame by frame I found something in the footage that, that really kind of intrigued me and I wanted to figure out what it was there were these kind of like these, you know, foot long white like rods of some kind just kind of darting through the water. They're moving so fast that I never saw them uh, while we were down in the water. Uh, and, and then it was, it was just something I never seen before or heard of and which is basically underwater like flying rods. I did a little bit of research and studied and, and found out that they have these um, you know, there's there's stories and reports of these flying rods in the sky. Our efforts pay off. This video shows rods moving back and forth across the screen. Here you can cl clearly see the membranes on each side, allowing the rod to swim through the air. Some are a few inches long, others a few feet. But how do we know they aren't just insects? Or and you know, this kind of mystery, and nobody really knows what they are. They're not really sure if it's real or not. Um, I kind of, you know, then became a student of it, trying to figure out what it was that I that I had witnessed. Um, still don't know what they are. It's a complete mystery. I'm gonna just kind of show you some of the footage and and just slow it down so you can see them. And, and there's gonna be one clip where you'll see the kind of the the rod just kind of darting through. And as I go frame by frame, you can kind of see, you know, around it. You know, just I don't know if they're like little tentacles or whatever it is, but. Something is propelling those things and making it move extremely fast and you know that to the naked eye you're really not going to be able to see them. So I'm going to take you through a few frames and, and so you can see what it is that I'm talking about. Here you'll see uh, some of the rod, you know, as the silky moves through the water then you're just going to, you're going to catch a few frames of, of, of these rods kind of darting through the area. And then there's a group of us all together. Uh, swimming under this buoy under the right next to the line and then all of them a, a big school of them just kind of shoots through the frame and, and I'll slow it down so you guys can see what I'm talking about but I mean it happens so fast and it's pretty exciting you know it's exciting that like well, okay maybe they already been discovered by science I don't know never heard of them never seen them before and I just you know thought it was really exciting to find uh, something like this out there you know it's just it's just really cool Really what excites me about finding stuff like that is that there's still so much that we don't know about the ocean. There's still so many mysteries out there and there's so much left to do, man. It just gets me excited about wanting to get back out there and, and you know, because you never know what you're going to find.